he only had took one trade right because i was in i was really skeptical with how it's happening so i only took one trade also on gold i took one trade so if i could hit this take profit live it would be crazy because uh as you can see we managed to pass that level we are currently on this level so i'm looking forward to hitting it somewhere right about here i'll be closing i just need that last push of us 30 before closing these trades from my other funded account so yeah man looks like it's reversing i'm not sure if i should close but i have a high i have high confidence on this trade so i'm not gonna close i have high confidence on this trade. i believe in it i believe i'm still gonna drop hard um yeah it's just a matter of fact of patience and seeing how things turn out because you can see this is us 30 let's go look at gold let's look at gold um here's gold so with gold we were there i was anticipating the first entry to be there but unfortunately i couldn't catch it right here i just had to scale in as soon as i saw there's a bit of momentum coming in um i just wish it could drop 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 because you could see we are, we're from a correction market so it could actually drop up until somewhere right about here but it's a matter of fact of patience man it's a matter of fact of patience it's really hard to you know, when you hit such profit, you're thinking, fuck, should I close? Should I hold? Should I close? Should I hold? But at the same time, I'm just like, nah, right. Uh, let me just hold this trade and see what's going on. You feel me? Let me just hold this trade and see what's going on. Um, so you can see that. So. That's the main thing, man. That's what's big. You feel me? That's the main thing, if you could just drop and give me that bit of push to the downside. Yeah. So, I'm trying to see that. I'm trying to see that. I'm trying to see that. <clears throat> I, I, you know what? One, one thing that mostly annoyed me is the fact that I took one position on US 30, right? And that it dropped quite crazy. I didn't expect it to do that. I feel like maybe I was a bit skeptical with like opening a lot of positions, you know. Um, I was a bit skeptical with opening a lot of positions. But maybe if I had like three positions, I'd probably be running on um, because currently, currently, um, see, um, currently, um, one US 30 position is running 3.6. So you could multiply that by three. If I had to take two trades, this means it could have been the craziest for me. Could have been the craziest, bro. Could have been the craziest if I took that. But patience, man. That's all what matters. Patience. That's what's important. Patience is what's important. I'm just going to keep on scaling and looking what's going on. Um, hoping for the market to drop furthermore with no disturbances. But we all know, man, there's, there's going to be a bit of pullbacks on it which extremely takes high patience for the for you to like be comfortable with the pullbacks uh Mornay, hey brother how are you man i'm chilling i'm chilling i'm chilling i'm chilling so yeah us state is close to eating my profit i just need that one last push to it i just want to hit that that if you can give me that one last push one i don't need a lot i just need one last push and then it's gone if us 30 could give me that one last push yo right of flicks brody what's going on what's going on what's going on what's going on yeah if us 30 could give me that one last push as you can see right now we kind of went up we are running five thousand we are running five thousand um two hundred profit we are running 5,200 profit. If I could hit it live, that would be crazy, bro. Yeah, so yeah. this is a funded account. Um, this is a funded account by Leveled Up Society. Yeah. Yay, Brody, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, Brody. I'm good, man. No cap. I'm good. I'm good.
I want to hit this take profit live. Hopefully, I don't. Let me see. How far, how many pips are we left before we hit the target? Um, fuck, we are still we are still a bit far though. We kind of is still a bit far because we need like let me see how many points. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. We need nineteen points or nineteen pips before we hit the overall trade profit. We need nineteen pips. Just nineteen pips. Yeah, but I believe it's gonna come though. I believe it's gonna come, no lie. I certainly believe it's gonna come. Could you please analyze um Bro, niggas are saying my signals are whack. Me? Hey, my brother, visit my, my, my free channel. You'll see. Everybody talks, man. Everybody has a mouth. Everybody has a mouth. I'll be sharing some of my views, actually, today. I'll be sharing some of them. It might take long. Bro, how can you enter when the market has already moved so hard? Like, it doesn't make sense. How would you want to enter when the market has moved so hard? Patience, my brother. There's always another opportunity. There's always going to be another opportunity. Hey, man, it's crazy. It's crazy. Still running, still running. Still running. If US thirty could run five thousand dollars profit alone, yeah, that would be insane. If US thirty could run five thousand profit alone, that would be crazy. But looking at it, it might as well do that. So I'm just I'm just actually trialing stop. I'm just moving the stop loss below entry, stop loss below entry, and stuff like that. Yeah, we just hit 5.3 now. We just hit 5.3. Hey, guys, don't enter. You're going to cry. <laughs> don't enter. You are going to cry. Hmm? You never enter on a trade when it's already gone because if it pulls back, it pulls back with you. So, in the meanwhile, let me look at some other trades. Um, I can see USDJPY is pulling back with the buys. I entered the buys today, but it dropped quite drastically. Um, Cat CHF still dropping quite nicely. I just missed the entry right there. Yeah. Euro GBP. Euro GBP still looks like a good sell though. I don't lie, Euro GBP still still looks like a good sell. No lie. It essentially still looks like a good sell. Um Let me see something. Let me see something. Yeah, Euro GBP still looks like a good sell though. But I don't want to be running a lot of a lot of trades at once. It's not gonna go up until it hits my take profit, man. I know what I'm doing. I genuinely know what I'm doing. Now, nah, but Euro GP is gone though, so I don't have to chase that trade. Okay, you're okay. Pulls back, pulls down, pulls back, pulls down. It's crazy. 
And another, another trade that's been tricky has been, um, what is this? Um, GP, GPCHF. It's been going up and down. If I die, I die. Man. This, is the, this is the world of God. He's the one that will tell me when am I going to die. Not a human being. What the fuck? Holy fuck, GBP AUD finally broke that level. Damn, that's crazy. Damn. All right, I just put my resistance somewhere at about there. I want to see something, if it will respect it or what. Um, let me just put my levels to see where can I possibly expect the retest. Um, I could possibly expect the retest on 1.7... 1.76800 1.76800 GP AUD you can expect the retest right there we just have to be patient enough with it um, even audio SD started dropping there's somebody today who analyzed and said he's gonna buy watch and see um, even took the, the, the screenshot of it I probably gonna laugh at him Probably gonna laugh at him. So let me guess. Um, USD is gaining strength right now. Yeah, USD is gaining strength. I'm wondering why is Euro USD buying? I'm wondering why Euro USD is buying. USD is gaining strength. Yeah. I mean, you're already selling, sorry. Um, but the sales just started though. So we just gotta wait for enough confirmation before we enter. How much is my mentorship? Go look at my bio. Guys, you, got, you guys ask obvious questions. Yeah, you guys ask obvious questions. Yeah, US 30 and is still dropping quite nicely. Gold is still dropping quite nicely. Let's see how far are we. Okay, US 30 is currently on 4,000 profit. Yeah, US the craziest, craziest moment. And look, take a look at that. US 30 is running on $4,000 profit, one position. $4,000 profit on one position. Gold is running 1.4. Um, yeah, man. Um, US 30. I, I just wanted to, to hit $5,000 one position. You see, if you could hit that, then I know uh, we're certain, man. we certain. Then I know we're certain, crazy certain. So, right now, it's just a matter of fact of patience and waiting to see what the market would do. Um, and all of that. So, let me see something. Um, my take profit is right there. All right. I think it's time now to move my stop loss as well because I don't want to be taking unnecessary profits back to the market, man. Hey, Forex is something else. It can turn your best trade into your worst nightmare. Um, 190990, 190.90, 190.90, stop loss secured on US 30. Let's see where we can put our stop loss. Um, um 36 let's see 36 um 36 yeah three three zeros yeah three three six zero six three three six zero six three three six zero six modify so now both positions are protected and they are still dropping crazy fool. Fuck. <laughs> they are still dropping crazy i think i'm gonna remove my take profit Nah, but it's still far. It's still far. On gold, it's still far. Um, on US 30, it's still far a bit too. So, yeah. 
I listen to Tusi guys, favorite artist, NBA Youngboy, but as well as Tusi, it's craziest with lyrics. It's craziest. Guys, we are climbing high, man. We are climbing high, man. Look, we are now running 6,000 profit. Crazy. We are now running $6,000 profit. That's 100K in South Africa, bro. $6,000 profit. That's 100K in South Africa. And as I said, I want US 30 to at least run $5,000 profits on one position. Then we would be good. Take a look at it. Um, I just don't want to show you my account balance. Yeah. Take a look at this melt. Take a look at this melt. Damn. Take a look at this melt. Take a look at that candle, man. Shit. Take a look at it. Take a look at it. Um, we just want to hit that. This is a four-hour time frame, man. We caught it at the store. Shit. Shit. See, we're just waiting with this move before take profit. Then we good. That last move before take profit, then we good. Still quite nice. Um, as well as gold. Look, look, let's take a look at gold. So with gold, we, we saw this. Um, we saw this on gold. Let me go on a one-hour scale. On a one-hour scale, that's where it's kind of visible, right? Take a look at that. So we saw this. We saw that. Let me put my phone in escape. So if you can look at it, this is what we saw on gold. We saw a rising channel, right? And then a correction impulse, which was supposed to respect this double top position, which is right here, right? But obviously the market won't always respect like that. So instead it spiked up until there. It spiked up. And then from there, we are waiting for it to hit here. Then we would be good with these trades. Waiting for it to hit here. Then we out of both trades. Um, looking forward to closing something very nice on these trades, man. Something very nice on these trades. No lie. Something nice on these trades. Crazy, fool. Crazy. Um, and then analysis on US 30, as you can see. Um, here is it. So with US 30, to be honest with you, I saw head and shoulders. So the market pushed to the upside. Okay, let me go on a four hour scale. Maybe it will show quite visible. Um, here's this is the four hour time frame. Don't get it confused. So we saw this push to the upside, correction downwards, up uptrend. And I was like, okay, cool. So see, this since this is a less sensitive area when you broke it, and then we're starting to drop. So I'm waiting for it to hit that take profit right here. Right here. Then we'll be out of the trade. Let me go on a five minute time frame. Okay, it's still pushing, but it spiked a bit down. Spiked a bit down. Um, and you see, we, we protected profits, guys. We don't take unnecessary profits back to the market. You see, this is stop loss um, below entry. So either or the market comes back, it's going to take me out of profit. Either or you could see it's a head. I mean, it's a shoulder. Another he a head and a like right shoulder. Just that one spike. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. And as well as here, we're just waiting for it to cover this. So we're probably left with one, um, three. So we like here left with like six pips before we hit the overall take profit. We kind of like left with six pips before the overall take profit. So yeah. Shit crazy, man. Fuck. Shit crazy, fool. No lie. Ah, man. It's, it's even beyond being the king of prize action, man. You just gotta understand, you know, what's going on in the market, what happens, and stuff like that. That was gonna... Um, 33584.55. 33584.55. 33584.55. Don't mind me counting. I'm actually secure in profits, guys. Hey, I don't like taking unnecessary profits back to the market. Forex is a scam. Eh. 19, um, let me see, 19, 1907, 
1907 7 .33. So yeah, we good now. We good now. Trades, can you just fucking go off, bruh? Say, fucking pissing me off, man. Let me actually go check the dollar index. I feel like it can also direct me what's going to happen so that I know where to respect, to expect the reversal and stuff like that. buying um, I haven't been looking at GJ for a while nah bruh it just rejected there's a difference between buying and rejection
Let's see what's going on, what's causing the pullback. Oh, it hit the other low. Oh, I see. Oh, it hit the other low. There's a low where US 30 is currently reversing. There's a low there. Ah, but if it thinks I'm gonna. She likes skin tree, she no moment that she tree go. Checking the beat. It's pushing a bit up. It's pushing a bit up. But if we close this ass out, at least we would have locked like five thousand dollars profit. We would have locked five thousand dollars profit, which is crazy for the day, man. You feel me? Why do I wait? Because I want to. Because I want to. Okay, it's rejecting again at the top. Must just, just straight shoot up, shoot down now. Yeah, let's go down, let's go down, let's go down. We're trying to close seven thousand dollars. But you know what it is, guys. Um, I think I'll go live again once we are close to hitting the target. Then I'll go live again. Andy, when are you unfair? I'm unfair how? What do you mean I'm unfair? It rejected though. Come on. Yeah, but guys, I'll come back once I've hit the take profit. 